Uh, what is the number one trait a guy can have other than driving a forklift? So what would you say? Personality. Personality? Yes, okay, sir. sweet. Nasca. Someone who will go to Costco with you. Do you want to go to Costco? Oh. <laughs> How you feel? Trying to keep it real. Climbing up the hill. Trying to get a deal. Trying to get a meal. Hungry on the beat. So before I get into the video today, I just wanted to disclose something real quick. I changed the name of my channel. I changed it from far more to my name. The reason I did that was because I want people to, you know, look at my name and like it make it a little bit easier whenever you're searching it because a lot of people forget the name far more. I don't know how. It's just, you know, how it is. But I just feel like if somebody looked up a concrete name instead of my brand, it would be a lot easier to look up. And plus, whenever you look up far more, it pulls up this video from R. Kelly. I'll put it on the screen right here, but I don't know. I'm tired of defending that not being me. There's like minor differences. Like I'm not black. Uh, I just at the same time, I just want people to search my name and, um, you know, not necessarily give like wake up Wednesdays and stuff like that. But, you know, tell y'all analogies and how I think of things in my videos and actually influence you as an influencer, not as like a, a video that has a topic and a, a subject and stuff like that. So I hope y'all like that. And, um, Make sure to like and subscribe because there's plenty more to come. And I just wanted to make sure that my account gets as accessible as possible and it helps as many people as possible because far more, just because it's not the name of the channel doesn't mean it ain't just as big in my heart. So far more. Let's get to that workout. So you know before we start this workout, we got to do the complimentary crack. I think that should be a new tradition because uh, I drink rains more than most crackheads do crack. So uh, Rainbow Sherbert, best flavor. Sponsor me, baby. <laughs> so I'm here with Okay, so I got a question for both of you What is the most attractive trait in a guy other than being a forklift certified? <laughs> I'm gonna say loving Jesus Bless him? <laughs> what about you, Brian? Come on um, Effort Effort? Yep Okay That's yep. a good one right there <laughs> Anything else? Um, you know, honesty, loyalty, there's lots. There's yeah. a lot. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you. You're welcome. it down. Okay. They're fixing me up over here. Midnight Sky got me set up. I got my far more right here. Nothing on the back. But look, that's why we got this puppy. Got this one right here. It's got the other logo on it. Got the big circle on there. Comment which one y'all like the most, and uh, we're going to see about them. See what we can do. All right, so today we're going to be doing the public interview. We got to see if girls think it's, you know, if there's something more attractive than driving a forklift and being certified. I don't think there is. Sam doesn't think there is. Nate especially, because he is forklift certified as well. But we're going to get to the bottom of it. Oh, yeah, you worked at Walmart. I'm forklift certified. He also is. Too. I didn't mean that, dude. I didn't mean that. So we're going to be interviewing up at Bridge Street, and then we're going to be going to Parkway Place in Huntsville. Let's see the answers. We got we to figure them out. That's what I'm here for. OVO. <laughs> Get it. It's Drake. Drake Avenue. <sighs> okay. Okay, so we're at Parkway Place right now. We're in the parking lot. Uh, we got to find some people to interview. You know, we haven't seen any so far. We saw some walking in, but, um, you know, we didn't catch them in time. We're going to probably have to go in that building to see what's up. And I'm down. Let's go. What we're doing is we're doing an interview to see, other than being forklift certified, what's the most attractive trait a guy could have? What's the most attractive job a guy could have? No, like attractive trait, other than being forklift certified, because that is without a doubt the most attractive. Okay. No. 
Okay, so here we go. Other than that, what would be the most attractive trait a guy could have? Like, what are you looking for in your next man's? I mean, I guess a job. Like, as long as he's a hardworking man, that's all I'd want. So for sure the payroll, that's what they need to have. I mean, I don't want his money, but as long as he can provide for himself, because, I mean, I'm going to have it regardless. So as long as he can provide for himself, then that's it. There you go. Sweet. Awesome. So I'm here with... Abby. Okay. Hey, Abby. So... What is the best trait a guy can have other than being forklift certified? That's number one. I know. I can see it in your eyes. <laughs> um, height. He has to be tall. Okay. So a tall guy. Is a uh, 5'10", is that doable? Yeah, he's taller than me, so that's doable. Okay. Heck yeah. <laughs> Sweet. So what's your name? Bella. Okay, Bella. I'm Zach. So just like I asked her, like guys have the trait, they have the it factor. But other than driving a forklift, what would that be? What's the most attractive trait in a guy? He has to have a personality. Personality? Okay, oh, sweet. can't be boring. So they can't be boring. No. That is for sure. I like that. Heck yeah. Walking around the mall right now, and, you know, we've seen a couple of people, but I think we're going to have to start going in the stores that have a bunch of females in there. Um, we'll find some more, but obviously we want to talk to some females. We're trying to figure out for ourselves, and uh, we're going to go speak to them. I'm just going to ask you, you know, we're all looking for something in somebody, you know, but what is the number one trait a guy can have other than driving a forklift? Like that's number one, hardworking man. Truck driver. Truck driver? Truck driver. Okay. I'm a truck driver. Oh, uh, yeah? Yeah. I hey. feel like that's hard work. It is. Because you have to, like, do long hours. You have to stay on the road for a long period of time. Yes. And you have to sleep in the truck for the most part. I know I couldn't do it, like, 100%. I'll yeah. stick to my forklifts, but, I mean, truck driving, that's next level. That's what I'm going to go to next. But we're trying to just figure out this one question. We're all trying to get girlfriends, right? <laughs> and we need to know what the number one trait a girl is looking for other than driving a forklift. I know forklift certification number one. Hard working man. I don't know. I really don't know. Like, you don't know what you're looking for in a guy? Um, he has to have, I don't know, what I look for, like, he has to have a job. Like, okay. You know, you have to be able to, like, support yourself, like, you know, be independent. Um, that's really it. That's like, yeah. So bringing in the big bucks, like that's yeah, for like, sure number I'm, one. Like, I'm not trying to make it seem like I'm a go digger. No, like, it's okay. Just like, it's yeah. okay. Look, yeah. I want a hardworking woman too. Yeah. That's what I need. Independence for sure. Yeah. So we're leaving Forever 21. We're just interviewing everybody we can see. Look, I'm just trying to show you that interviewing people is kind of hard. Like, don't get me wrong, get a little uncomfortable, get a little hot. But you know what? I'm here to figure stuff out. And if y'all can't do it, then I'm going to take care of it and show you. The question is, what is the most attractive trait a guy can have other than being forklift certified? I would say honesty. That's and, a good one. Um, sense of humor. Sense of humor. Heck yes. And good character. Good character. Yep. Okay. I got a lot of work I need to do. So, like, if you were about to date a guy, like, if you were just going out, like, you know, checking people out, like, what would you find the most attractive trait? Like, muscles, look? Uh, as a girl, as a boy. As a girl. As a girl, think, for to sure. To be honest. Yes. Uh, to be honest, to have fun, to be understandable, yes. to have each other back. That's a really good yeah. one. This is amazing. Masa is good, but after, it's not the first priority. To be understandful, to understand you, to support you, have fun, yes. trustful. So you just want somebody that understands you and just can have fun and like y'all, you know, pretty much build each other up. Independent. Yes, independent. Like a hundred percent, like everybody yeah, wants yeah, that. Like this, yeah. Heck yeah. Well, thank you so much. Hey, ma'am, I have a couple of questions for you. Yeah, I like a quiet guy too. Right? See, what would be the number one trait in like the next girl y'all pick up? All right, let me get over there. She's got to be able to cook. Wait, wait, wait. We'll go down the line. <laughs> okay. So what would you say? Personality. Personality? Sure. Okay. Yes, sweet. Nice guy. No dents in the car. No dents in the car? Just make sure they don't wreck all the time. Yeah, I look for that too. I don't want to well, beat up Honda Civic. Driving a uh, Nissan Altima. Okay. Look, that's two things I avoid. I thought it was just me. <laughs> Alright, man. Last but not least. Her what? Cook her cooking skills. Cooking skills? Okay, so cereal and PB&Js, this ain't going to cut it. No, it's no. not. She's got to 
that make me like, I don't know, good stuff, fancy stuff. You know? Oh, yeah. Like spaghetti. The spaghetti and meatballs. Yeah. First of all, what is your name? Christine. I'm Zach. Pleasure Hi. to meet you. So we're trying to figure out what is the most attractive trait a guy can have other than being forklift certified. Because that, that is, is number one. It is number one. Number one, yeah. I would say kind and thoughtful. Okay. I'm more about the inside than the outside. That is amazing to hear. Heck yeah. Well, I appreciate I do it. A backwards hat. Okay. What about That's blonde? <laughs> <laughs> what about a tan I'm shirt? Also someone who will go to Costco with you. Do you want to go to Costco? Oh. <laughs> I just went. <sighs> Let's go back. Would you take me for pizza and a <laughs> icy? Okay. Yes. Okay. Well, thank you. All of the fixings. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, it was a pleasure to interview you. Thank you. I appreciate you. We've got a good bit of interviews up in here, but we need to go somewhere outside a little more uh, exclusive. We're going to check out old Bridge Street. More interviews to come. Parkway Place was a success. We got a lot of valuable information. Did you learn anything, Sam? I learned how to not only approach women, but I learned how to better myself as a man. Okay, but other than that, did you see any fine honeys? Uh, <laughs> Never mind, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Sam, that was a good answer. Uh, okay. My, my, um, uh... <laughs> yeah. Okay, look, let's just uh, let's skip over him for a second. Okay, Nate, what did you learn? Tell me something. Um, today I learned that there's nothing more important than being forklift certified. That was a good answer. Thank you. Person. God, you're so hot. How big is your beard? Um, Question mark? Not big enough is what I'm told. <laughs> Second biggest rocket I've ever seen. In today's video, guys, you'll see Zach try to tell me how to video people. I've already done it before. Um, this is nothing new to me. Um, I'm a god, okay? He is a god. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. don't show the camera that. Sorry, I just. We're gonna be interviewing people, asking them what's the most attractive thing other than being a forklift driver. Hi, I'm Alex. So we're all just dying to know, like, what's the most attractive trait a girl can have? Like, what do I need to look for? Because you've got all the wisdom in the world. you got the clean suit. You're looking <laughs> good. All that. Look. Uh, I'm going to have to say a nice smile. A nice, nice smile. smile, something to look for in every girl. Heck, yeah. I'm the exact same way. I love a smile. I love some good eyes, rocking body. That's, that's all you can ask for, right? <laughs> La, 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 la. So here we got Katie. Okay, nice to meet you, Katie. So we're just running around asking, what is the most attractive trait in a man other than being forklift certified? Height. Height? Okay. <laughs> well, you know. Hey, right, dude, look, it's all good. You're still looking good. Come on. Don't listen to me. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> it's extremely hot out here. And um, getting denied left and right. But we're also getting a bunch of uh, meaningful like, interviews. You ain't gonna get them all. But it's the fact that you asked. So, what is the most attractive trait a guy can have other than being forklift certified? Um, personality and then just like kindness. Kindness and personality. Yeah. Sweet. Well, I, I think I got both of those, so, <laughs> you know, I'm really excited about that. Hopefully I can get me a girlfriend one day. All right, today we're here interviewing... Maddie. Maddie, nice to meet you. Nate, nice to meet you. And today the question is, what is the most attractive trait in a man other than being forklift certified? Uh, he just has to be forklift certified. If he's not, like, I don't want him, I'm sorry, stay like away that. from me. Yeah. I'm Home. forklift certified today. You know what, guys? <laughs> Perfect. Right? So. Sweet. Yeah. What's my Snapchat? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Nathan. What is it, Nate? I forgot. Uh, Nathan Andrew hey, 28. You guys got to be a little more prepared. Come on. I know, right? Nathan Andrew 28. Perfect. Okay. Nathan Andrew 28. What is the most attractive trait a girl can have, other than being forklift certified? Because I think that would be pretty attractive. <laughs> um. I'm pretty sure personality, that's the most attractive trait for me, for sure. It is true. What about when you first see them? Um, first see what? First see them. First see them? No, when you first see them. Oh, when I first see them. Yes. Um, smile, eyes, body. 
just everything. Sweet. So we are here with Amanda. Nice to meet you, Amanda. Nice so you. other than being forklift certified like your husband, what is the most attractive trait a guy could possibly have? I think being endearing and understanding. Those are both really good, good quality <laughs> things. A lot of people would say pecs, biceps, but you got wholesome ones. I mean, wholesome character, like I need you to be amazing when we're old and gray. Like all that stuff eventually just fades away. I need you to be a good person. It does. <laughs> well, hey, thank you so much for being here. We got denial. We got some approvals. We interviewed. We got the answer. Make sure to go into the comments and ask uh, what next me, Nate, and Sam should go and do. So like and subscribe and uh, far more as always. Stay beautiful, baby. Catch you later. <laughs>